Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you are having a great day. I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you guys, but I actually have another one. So I will attach it to this one. So when I get done with this, just stay with me. So I actually went in there and needed to get some essentials, like things I actually needed. I didn't just go in there just to, to see if they had anything fun and exciting. Um, so I got, I needed these aluminum foil sheets and it says 20% more. And they didn't have the Reynolds Wrap brand in, so I got these, um, but they, they seem to be okay. These are the 30 sheets, so it will last us a while. And then I got two of these Velveeta cheese, so cheese sauce packages. They had them in the original and they also had them in the jalapeno. Um, but I just got the two of the original for when we make um, macaroni and cheese. And then we needed tissues because um, ragweed is crazy around here and we're all sneezing. Um, I wasn't bad this morning with my nose running, but uh, I sneezed just a couple times. Um, but um, yeah, so we're definitely going through the tissues and winter's around the corner, so it's always good to be stocked up. So I got two of the um, Scotty's Triple Soft Aloe. It says aloe vera, three layers of softness. 54 tissues. So yeah, I got two boxes of those. I got three of the, um, the Sprite and then two of the Coca-Cola for the kids. And then we actually ran out of the Worcestershire sauce last night when we were making dinner. Um, we season our steaks in this and then we also use the, um, the steak seasoning um, for it poke holes in it and all that before we put it on the grill and it's just our steaks just turned out delicious and tender. So um, typically we always have one as a backup and we did not. So I got one of those, which I probably should have got two. And then I did get two of these. These are the, um, the A1 steak sauce. Um, and we love the A1. We like the Heinz 57 too. Um, but we do try to stay stocked up with the A1. And then I saw these, and so, you know, couldn't resist because the watermelon are my most favorite. They, so they had um, the watermelon and the, um, uh, oh, green apple. Our store has not had the lemon yet, or at least one of our stores hasn't had the, the one that I was in hasn't had our lemon yet. So curious to see if they get those in. And then um, I got a thing of the movie theater butter popcorn, the Browns, for my husband because I noticed that he had used the last of his um, on his nightstand. So I got him another one. And then I picked up a thing of the lemon lime um, juice because we always like to have that on hand. And then I picked up one of the Marcel's Modern Pantry, 2% reduced fat milk. That's what we like. Um, and I noticed that <clears throat> we were down to one in our pantry. So I figured I better pick up another one. And then uh, I picked up a thing of this Swan brand antiseptic mouth rinse it's in the spring mint. I don't typically get it from there. I typically get the whitening and we usually get it in the two packet Sam's. Um, <clears throat> but I did go ahead and pick this up. We haven't, we haven't been to Sam's in a minute, so I guess I've got to I've started a Sam's list, so I guess we need to get there soon. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and um, attach the other video to this, so stay with me. Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope y'all are having a great day. Um, so I had a Dollar Tree haul and I said I would add one onto it that I had, so this is the one. Um, these are Crafty Finds. I was so excited. Um, if you watched my, I had put out a couple new shorts lately for Dollar Tree. And if you've watched them, then you would have seen me show that Dollar Tree, our Dollar Tree, has like resin and things like that. Which is like, <laughs> mind blowing that Dollar Tree is selling like they're so stepping up their game. It's just insane. Just when you think that, oh gosh, they haven't gotten anything new in. Oh my goodness. You know, I can't find anything good. And then boom, 
you go into the craft aisle and there is resin and resin products and you're like okay they're back in the game back in the game so with that being said i wanted to show you the resin molds that i found let me see how many did i find two there were more than two if you looked on that short of mine um but there's two that i picked up so i got the pet tag mold like a little doggy mold and I just can't believe for $1.25 and I actually have resin stuff here so that's really cool that um that they had that because we can make something like it shows you can make a keychain but I'm sure there's lots of other things you can make come here Ruby and then also they have the jewelry mold which is really neat because there's three different types of earrings that you can make and I have lots of the little um, hooks for the earrings um, so definitely we'll be making um, something with that and these will make wonderful gifts too so I'm excited to sit down and use those I may have to pick up some more um, resin because it has been a while since I used that kit my daughter and I were making things back well gosh probably a year and a half ago maybe two years ago I don't I don't think it's been quite two years ago but I think it's probably been like a year and a half ago so hopefully the resin doesn't um mess up over time you know as far as the consistency of it um doesn't so we'll see and then they had these little faux fur pieces and I was actually on the phone with um, my daughter and I had went in there and actually I was on the phone with Lois from Life with Lois and um, I was telling her that they had these and I was like they're so pretty they had so many different colors um, gray black I want to say they had like a um, I don't think they had pink they had kind of like a bluish color like a um, like a it's kind of like a teal blue but lighter um, they had like three or four different colors and I said that I really um liked them but I just couldn't think of what I was you know what I could do with them and, and I said but I'm gonna at least get one so I can so I can have it um because I know I'll find something for it and Lois said well what about your shadow box because her and I are doing a collab in October um on October 1st actually at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time <laughs> um, and she said you could use it for the background and I said that's a great idea so I got the gray for what I'm doing for my shadow box Ruby come here I don't trust her she's in here and I don't know what she's doing she had an upset stomach earlier so that's the last thing I need on this carpet uh, come here Rube. Um, but then I was super duper excited because I saw my friend Kathy over at Cat Cast and Cali. I saw her haul some Dollar Tree goodies and she had found some diamond painting. And I was like, what? That's a Dollar Tree. <laughs> and so I was like, I feel like I saw something like that kind of laying on a shelf at the bottom, just kind of just stacked up and I never pulled it out to look at it. So I was like, next time I go in there, I'm going to look. I'm glad I did because guess what? Ours had the diamond paintings. And this one is the tiger. Look how beautiful. So really neat. And that's the whole kit that it comes with. And then, um, then they had this one. I think all three designs that they had, I got all three. I don't think they had anything other than, than these three, which are really nice. Um, and then they had like the Toucan Sam. And again, that's everything that it get that glare off of there that's everything that it comes with so really really cool and these make great gifts too and i got two of these um and then this one the watering can with the flowers and i thought that was really pretty and i was just like are you kidding me for a dollar 25 yes please so yeah i actually probably gonna go back and get more because they do make wonderful gifts and it's a great idea so yeah, great, great, great. So that is my Dollar Tree haul. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button and that bell notification and you won't miss any of my uploads. And until next time, bye y'all.